Well, hey everybody, what's up? Don't click off the video yet. MX Bikes content is coming. I promise, I promise, I promise. Listen, I just wanted to apologize for being gone for three months. It's been crazy the last part of 2021, and now into 2022, I'm making a commitment to uh, upload a lot more MX Bikes content. So please stick around for that. I'm sorry for my audience. I've missed you guys, missed the community a whole bunch. I'll be streaming on Twitch as well here pretty soon. So if you haven't found me on there, just the same channel name, Clip Clip. That's where you can find me everywhere. But hey, um, I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, there will also be some uninterrupted uh, writing after the video. So if you want to do that, I will timestamp the timestamp right here if you want to just skip to some uninterrupted writing. But the first track review of the year, Supercross stuff, Anaheim 2022. So guys enjoy. I really like this track. And uh, again, sorry for being gone for so long. But uh, yeah, here you go. All right, so here we are, Anaheim 2022. I always love that they put the pit area. A lot of, like, attention to detail, so I always love that kind of stuff. But uh, as you guys know, I am a super huge fan of Supercross stuff. And, uh, oh, my gosh, oh, my gosh, I'm already, like, wrecking around and stuff. Give me just a second here. Um, but I'm a huge fan of Supercross stuff. I guess I should have taken the start. Let me let me go do that real, real quick. Uh, anyways, start sweeps around here like it does, and I would say that this track replica does justice to the actual track um, that they rode in real life and it's it's super awesome because um i like tracks that will follow the actual track in real life it's one of my favorite things so um this is a super flowy track if you can get it down but there are some pretty tough lines i'm not gonna lie i mean like you've got some technical areas of stuff like that triple double that double super hard uh to not over jump and then these as well the triple and then double out like you see how i just bounced that like it's super difficult but um it's really fun the only thing i don't like about this track and obviously it, it claims some victims also in real life is that run up to the freaking whoops these things suck so bad so you can't really get a good run up to them and it's hard to like get any sort of traction to try to uh, do anything with and wow i just botched that a bunch usually you can triple up onto that table and uh, not suck as bad as i do but that that was really really bad Probably my favorite part of the track right here. If I can get it down this next time, I'll do it. But uh, I, you can triple in and then almost like triple out and then single. And that completes that whole area section. Uh, but I'm telling you, if you don't get your lines right on this, you're going to have a tough, tough time with, with uh, getting a good flow on this track. It's it's definitely a fun one, though. So if you can get the flow down and everything, yeah, I, I really... Uh, really like it so i'm really excited to see what the rest of 2022 brings with mx bikes as far as supercross goes I'm really excited for it obviously motocross as well but supercross is starting to really have a special place in my heart just because it's so rewarding it's so fun um and there's just it's so much to do but uh this track again uh aerial uh, sx i believe is the name of it Man, i'm really sorry if i'm botching it you guys are probably watching this and it's awful and i am very sorry for that but uh, if you guys want to find it i'll have the link in the description below um as i said it's it's not too hard to find you can download it i'm not sure if the track password will still be on there whenever you download it um here's a section i was talking about man i really like this if you can get it down really like correctly still didn't hit it perfect that time but um yeah, you guys go ahead and go download this. It's awesome support the creator. It's super, super sick. And I know that they'll probably have the entire series like they did last year. And I want to upload every single one of these this year. That's kind of like the thing that I want to do for sure is a track upload and track review of each one of these tracks as they come out. And I would uh, be glad to do it because I know that I'm a huge fan of Supercross on here. And I know a bunch of other people are too as well. Okay, 103, that's not very good. I think it was running like straight up one minute um, the other day on this track. <laughs> what I think I have to do before I upload anything is actually like practice on these tracks so I don't suck so bad when I go into it. Because if I don't practice at all, it's gonna be really bad. There was a decent run through those right there. Okay, let's see if I can get this section down. Nope, still not gonna happen. You can triple up onto this table and it's so much better. Doing what I do is a lot slower right there. So we're gonna try as we come back around to do this again. This wasn't too bad of a hit there. That's pretty nice. All right. Here's that. Good to go there. Not too terrible. Yeah, I'm saying if you can get a good run on this, it'd be, it'd 
be a lot better, work out better for you in the end on those, for sure. Because uh, again, these whoops, I hate them so much. I hate those whoops with every being in my soul. There's no run up to them. You cannot get a good run trying to come up into it, but hey, it just is what it is. So, you know, if you're good at the game, you gotta adjust, right? <laughs> This section is so much fun if you can get it down correctly. It has so much speed coming in and then not hit tough blocks like I do. Like I got that tendency to. Also, a question for you guys. You guys are uh, up here watching at this point. Um, I've been wanting to call my track reviews behind the bars or behind the bars, stuff like that. But I think I'm going to keep putting track review before it. I know this is a weird, like, you know, thing. Oh, I can't get that. What is wrong with me? But, uh, you know, create a little bit of uniqueness. So when you see it behind the bars, that is a full-on track review from behind the bars. And this is exactly what I'm doing today. So uh, that's kind of what my goal is for that, especially with the regular uploads that I'm going to start doing this year. So this track is really fun. Also, what I really enjoy about these tracks, the more and more that I play mixed bikes, the thing that keeps me coming back to tracks Yes, the good flow and everything, of course, but if it's got a good environment, then I'll tell you it's a way for me to escape, you know, when I come back from a really long day at work or whatever, and I'm just like, hey, I want to get on some MX bikes, I want to escape for a while, I want to feel like I'm actually at the track, I'm telling you, an environment helps so much. I mean, they really, really do. So that's something I really like about these Supercross tracks and the stadiums is that it's a full-on environment. You feel like, you know, hey, I'm in this stadium. You can hear the crowd cheering. Like, that is so super sick to me. I, I absolutely love that. All right, not a bad run through these. Let's see if I can actually get this down this time. Here we go. Okay. Table up onto that and triple out. It's so much faster. So much faster. There we go. There we go. See, what I'm saying, if you can get a good flow to this track, it's it's so much better and not do those types of things. Oh my gosh, terrible. I'm gonna come back around to it. That was awful. Don't 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 be like me. Don't suck, because it's it's really bad. <laughs> I know there are probably people out there that are way, way better at supercross than me. In fact, it's 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 for sure a thing. So I am sorry if you're watching this as a supercross veteran on MX bikes. I know I'm botching it. I'm botching it real bad right now. But uh, you know, hey. I just wanted to get on here and do these track reviews because it's one of my favorite things to do, for sure. Because I know some people want to see those tracks, you know, all those things. I know what I'm like at work and stuff. And yeah, I'm watching YouTube at work. Listen, don't judge me. But I know when I'm not around at home, I'll put it that way, I like to watch reviews on, on tracks just to see what they're all about. And it, it makes me more excited to get home and, and download it and, and, and play it, honestly. It's, it's really something that I enjoy to do, for sure. All right, a couple more laps here. Let's see. It's a lot of fun. I'm on a 450 right now, and I know a couple of people have asked in previous videos my Supercross setup on things. You guys, I'm going to be dead honest. Y'all are going to laugh at me right now. I am bone stock on everything. I'm not even kidding. But I'll tell you, it, it just does me right. I'm comfortable. I, I really just like the stock setup. So that's just what I've stuck with, and I don't really want to change the formula because I'm used to it, and I feel like if I change stuff, it's going to be a lot harder to adjust, and then all the progress that I've made is going to go you know, down the drain, and I don't really, I don't really feel like doing that, you know what I mean? All right. Let's see if I can get a good lap in here. That over-under is actually one of the best over-unders I've ever hit in this game. It's really built really well. Triple. Here we go, that's a good good little section there. Just triple in, another triple. See, I overjumped that first triple, and it, that section is super hard to overjump, and I don't know if I can get all the way over to the next lines, you know what I mean? And so, it, it's hard. It's hard to like keep it under control. That was a bad run in, I'm sorry, y'all. Okay, let's see if I can actually get this. Maybe, yep. That's so smooth whenever you can hit it that way. So much smoother, and then just, you know, not do well on that. Hey, at least I doubled out, so that gives you prep for the corner a little bit better. Oof. Still hit it, still hit it. All right. Let's see if we can get a good, really good lap in here. We're certainly gonna try. Already off to a weird start by overjumping almost everything. The king of overjumping. I used to underjump stuff when I was still getting used to Supercross, and now it's like I overjump everything because I over anticipate. And I'm just like, listen, I gotta be full throttle all the time, okay? 
it's not the truth. <laughs> Something I've really learned about Supercross, and if you're here and, and you know, you're still trying to learn Supercross on MX bikes, I'll tell you it's all about throttle control completely. It is all about throttle control, not being too, you know, giddy to try to get onto the gas real quick because it'll it'll screw you up real quickly if you do that. Okay. Uh, it's sketchy, but it worked. It worked. Dang it. And see, now I'm saying not to get on the gas too much, and I'm just screwing that section up really badly. All right, one or two more laps here. This is this is really fun. By the way, I mean, there's there's that thing out in front, that thing. I don't know what they call it, but, like, you see the hotel out front and everything, and, and uh, all the objects around these stadiums are super nice. So to the creators of this track, you guys did a really, really good job. Like, fantastic. All right. Go. Triple's a whole lot of fun. All right. There we go. Yes. When I get real quiet, I'm sorry. It's good focusing. <laughs> if you haven't already guessed that. Perfect there, perfect. All right, don't screw the section up, you got it. There it is. Yes, it's so nice. It feels so good to, to like just kill those sections. Gosh, I love it. It's so awesome. Okay, one more for the crowd, here we go. All right, yeah, yeah, I'm telling you, if you can get it down, that's the key. That is the key, for sure. All right. There we go. Very nice. Right, this this bowl turn is so easy to slip on. You got to be really careful on it. Not even bowl turn. I don't know what to call it. Was it bowl at all? The flat turn. There, that, that's probably what I need to call it. <laughs> Listen, I'm not a flat track master. Oh, man. See, I started talking and screwed it all up. Oh, okay. All right, we'll come around. Once we hit the finish line, I'm going to do some raw laps here for y'all just to end out the video. All right, there we go. All right, guys. Well, I appreciate you all joining into this video. It's been a whole lot of fun. Um, I'm going to do some raw laps for you guys, just uninterrupted, no talking at all, and I hope you guys enjoy it. But again... Sorry it's been three months, but uh, hey, I promise that uh, I'm going to start doing some more regular uploads, especially these track reviews. I plan on doing a track review for every single one of the Supercross tracks coming out for this year. Uh, anyways, enjoy the raw laps, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.